is our Saturday Night House team, Fool's Pudding! <laughs> Uh, ladies and gentlemen, we are Fool's Pudding. We perform here every Saturday night, uh, and we do a forum called The Cameron Bean. But more importantly, tonight is the last show with Natalie O'Sullivan. She's been with us for a while. You're, you're in the front here. Come on. What? Yeah, you're going to have to get the kids. To get started is a suggestion of anything at all. Eureka! 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 Hey, uh, look at this little Rico right here. <laughs> what, what dog are you doing? Is this is like a possum, a raccoon? Uh, what kind of Rika is this? <laughs> You can find anything at my dollar store. <laughs> so, what you're telling me yeah. is that there are little animals that can get on your hands and that's what makes us sick? Yeah, yeah. And they're like little, small, minuscule animals. One cell, maybe two, and they fuck you up. <laughs> nice try, Dr. No, Lucy. don't touch me, man. <laughs> since the seance. likes us doing that. You got my back, right? I brought you here. You're my little brother. Yeah. You are. Happy? Pretty you happy? You're not, you're not, you don't work on a cover of the store, do you? Or would you rather have Gucci guilty? You <laughs> want that first thing you said. Of course. That one. Bergamot, jasmine, innocence. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's funny because, uh, we clearly have security footage showing you <laughs> trying more than one tester. I'm a choosy man, and I deserve to choose. <laughs> I deserve to choose. Choosy? Elizabeth, <laughs> <laughs> you choosy? Yeah, your employees are encouraging it. <laughs> Different? Numerable? <laughs> High maintenance? <laughs> high maintenance? Yeah. I am high maintenance. So that, would, that smells great. It smells like me. It smells like someone bottled my essence. We have this new, this new uh, scent in. It's called Asks What's Good. <laughs> Do 
you got pinched too? Yeah. Well, don't worry, I brewed up some good stuff in the toilet. Toilet? <laughs> yeah, I love the toilet! <laughs> All I got is a ladle though, so lean back. Alright. <laughs> <laughs> well, as you can see from the uh, chart here, boss, the number of band-aids found at Wet n' Wild has decreased since 2016. Oh boy. <laughs> Better injure more kids. <laughs> <laughs> yes, that is the conclusion I jumped to. <laughs> See, since then, Coca-Cola started using plastic bottles. We have to start using these glass ones again at the concession stand. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> hey, honey, did you, did you enjoy the big slide? I did, oh, I did. Did you, can you just uh, put a ton of ointment on my back? I, I think I'm going to get a whole new sheet of skin now. <laughs> yeah, they just Sweetheart. removed all the water from the water park. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Oh, all right. <laughs> Hi, is this lost and found? This is a oh. oh, Jiminy Crickets, I was going to bring it home to the kids, give it to oh, them as a blanket. <laughs> well, luckily there's still a bunch of uh, kids' retainers you can take home and play with. All right, these will make... You ever lose one of those at a water park? I have. These will make nice Lego bricks. Excuse me! Do you have do you have my tonsils? <laughs> yes, we do! Get your ass up here! <laughs> we, uh, we get a ton of tonsils here at Wet n' Wild. They just kind of come right down through the, the pipes. Uh, yes. You pick the ones which uh, most closely Excuse resemble me. your... Excuse me, I... Looking for a prolapsed anus. <laughs> <laughs> not, not mine. This is definitely one. Oh, wait, you don't wait, have wait, to be embarrassed. Wait a minute. Your wait a minute. Wait a minute. <laughs> That's not mine. Okay. No, it's not mine. Oh, good. My phone's cold. I mean, I mean, it's not my little brother's. All right, it's mine. You know, no, since... that's not mine. I'm looking for mine. No. I'm sorry. It's just that. Well, when I got here this morning, I, I was pregnant. <laughs> <laughs> Don't move. <laughs> Don't move a muscle. The spirit's nowhere here. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> to whom be I speaketh with? Whom? I don't know if that's the correct usage of the word whom. <laughs> you can call me Meredith. I, I know who this is. This is my sixth grade English teacher. <laughs> Meredith Fedberger. Uh, she died in this home. She was a bad English teacher. Yeah. Definitely who? I was watching I the <laughs> Because if you replaced it with here, it would use him, right? Right. To, to him. No, to I'm, I'm a lady. <laughs> She's a female. Why do we take our honeymoon here? <laughs> it's it's five funny. stars on Airbnb. Don't front. <laughs> but, Miss Federberger. Hmm? Why did I get a C plus? You were ugly. <laughs> Peter West, he's a ghost hunter now? I never thought that kid went about to anything. Oh my god, what a loser, right, Principal Stoddy? Oh my god. Hey, remember the teacher's lounge? Oh, the teacher's lounge. Oh, the teacher's oh, we lounge. Had some good stories back then. Mm. Oh, jeez, can you believe these friggin' spirits these days? Oh, I'll tell you. They are not ones to study for anything. I, I hate teaching here. That's my point. <laughs> this is the worst school I've ever haunted. Uh, maybe if you change your attitude a little bit, you'd uh, enjoy yourself. I'm not going to change my attitude. People, someone keeps taking my sandwich out of the fridge. You know, okay, the way I see it, uh, you got to bloom where you plant it. Yeah, Hello. you're a gym teacher. You I'm know, just maybe... a kid with a hall pass wandering around randomly. Oh! Oh, um, <laughs> whom is it? <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> That's the first time I ever pinched my cheek. Really? Yeah. You got the you got a lot of elasticity there. You should know that. <laughs> this is a, this is uh, some good one. I'm gonna Girls. save that. Point. I'm gonna save. Sweetheart, I don't want you fraternizing with the elastic boy. <laughs> he's, he's stinky and his skin's weird. He's <laughs> just a normal kid. He's not a normal kid. He is a blasphemer Shit. of the world. He's an abomination of the Lord. <laughs> I think you've just jumped to those conclusions yourself. He's a nice oh, dude. you tell me a Christian boy who has skin like that. <laughs> Uh, I will bring him home, Mama, but you ain't gonna like him. Oh, what's his, what's his quarry? <laughs> <laughs> he can burst into flames. He can burst into flames like the devil himself. That's right. <laughs> I don't like this. <laughs> Me Spanish. That's <laughs> <laughs> yeah. you're, like, you know, you're better than every babysitter I have. Usually they kind of just talk to their boyfriend, but you're educational as a babysitter. Angelo, I care about you. This is my job. Really? Yeah. You do care about me? Yeah. You're like the 12th babysitter that I've had, and no one's ever said anything like that. Let me get you some hot, cut up hot dogs and mac and cheese. Yeah, so I love it. Make you feel a little better. Yeah, uh, queso, we, uh, I don't know hot dogs. Um, el hot dog. <laughs> uh, that's a little more French, I think. Yeah. I can teach you some French for sure. Yeah, yeah, you'd be cool if you actually whipped up something really nice sometime instead of caught up hot dogs. And <laughs> <laughs> I have high blood pressure for a twelve-year-old. <laughs> yeah. Um, I guess I could whip up some uh, Cheerios. That's good for your blood pressure. <laughs> yeah. I only studied French and Spanish, not food, so... Oh. <laughs> <laughs> well, this is kind of a non-traditional college class. It's just called food. <laughs> We're just going to learn how to make toast. And, and thank you for joining us on lesson one, day one of food. <laughs> if you'll open up your textbooks to the page one, you'll see... Spaghetti. <laughs> if you continue to page two, you'll see pickles. <laughs> Hold on, Mr. Matthews is homesick today. I'm your substitute. He left a DVD for you to watch. It just says, uh, taco. <laughs> Kids, watch quietly. <laughs> Day 45! Taco! <laughs> End of disc! This is the shortest disc I've ever seen. <laughs> is, is there a second disc? Oh, okay. Oh, it's a mini series? <laughs> Day 45, taco port tube! <laughs> so, um, what we're filming is uh, an educational video. Okay. Uh, about, it's for the culinary arts. Uh, your role is you play, well, you dress up as a taco. Um, but we need you to, well, to really embody taco. Mm, okay. You know what I mean? Yeah, I think I get you. I, uh, I was in Jerry Maguire. <laughs> yeah, well, you know, I've been in uh, a lot of films, mm -hmm. so uh, it shouldn't be a stretch. Is it just a children's PSA or something? Uh, no, no, it's going to be used at the higher higher levels of culinary oh. education. Oh, Angelo, que rico! Hey, wait a minute, I know you. Yep. Didn't you play a taco in Jerry Maguire? Yes, I did. <laughs> I played a taco. You were the taco. Yeah, man. And you had that. I remember because in the DVD, can I sit? And the yeah, DVDs, sit. there was the uh, the deleted scene yeah. where you you like went ape shit on Tom Cruise. You were like, show me the taco. Yeah. And then you like disrobed. Yeah, I got fired from set. I got fired, but they still gave me the credit. They gave me the credit for the movie, and I still get residuals from it. You. 
complete me. Because I'm a bowl of salsa. <laughs> I've never seen this door before. We've lived in this house for like four years, and this door just appeared out of fucking nowhere. Yeah, get out. <laughs> <laughs> Took you long enough. Let's <laughs> get that. Is this? Oh, is this? Is this like a, like you're such a bad communicator? You like had a door installed in here just so you could do this moment. You were, like, looking forward to this for, like, so long? Yeah. God, that's sad. Well, you don't have to suffer anymore. You can skip. <laughs> Go on. <laughs> and then he came out with you with a broom? Yeah. And said scat and pushed you yeah, out? Yeah, it was like I was a kitchen mouse or something. <laughs> wow. Yeah, he, like, stood on the chair and was like... <laughs> <laughs> Why are you spreading rumors about me? I didn't squeal. I was a man about it. I was so strong. I said, move yourself from this you hole. You were so many octaves higher than you did. No, I were. wasn't. Wait, he went back in the house after he kicked you out of the door? He, like, door? he like, swept me out. And I was like, fuck you, I'm coming back in here. And he was like, you're a little, like, strong-ass little mouse. And I was like, yes, I am. And we kept talking for a while. <laughs> it's a relationship I wanted to save. Want to save. Still very invested in saving it. Are you sure? Yes, I've just told all of you this because I feel very passionately about it. Mm. Do you think if you ask me that way, I'll change my mind? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> hey, yo, so did you show Shelly the door? Like uh, I, I took me four years to build it. <laughs> and then I showed it to her. <laughs> and I said, Vamos. Wait a minute, wait a minute. I said show her the door. That just means kick her out. It doesn't mean it's a metaphorical door that I was talking about. Why? Metaphorical. Hey, so when I got this uh, stack of twenties right here that I am showing to you now, <laughs> as in you owe me rent. Show me the money. I've been looking forward to this. Show me the money. I'm awesome. I thought of that. Had that in my back pocket for a while. Wait, you had the rent in your back pocket this whole time? That's that's my rent for the last seven months. I haven't gotten your rent. I'm stacking up all of my rent so I could say, show me the money. This is why I built a door. You just oh. talk. <laughs> so cool. All right, honey, I think we should start trying to strategize for a honeymoon. Mm -hmm. And I'd like to show you some options on Airbnb. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Let's see. Ooh, computer stuff. <laughs> <laughs> mm. Oh, I like that. That's good. Yeah, it's nice. Yeah. It's like, um, it looks like a back of a Chevy truck. Oh, never been in a truck before. Really? Never no. been in a truck before? Never even seen one. <laughs> Wait a minute. Mm -hmm. Really? You've never seen a truck never before? Never seen a truck before. I don't know if I can marry you. I'm oh, a southern boy. Joker. I'm a southern boy. <laughs> you can't hurt God's name with these jokes. <laughs> I'm serious, not joking. I will not marry you unless you see a truck. <laughs> you have to see a truck. Oh my God, you're throwing this out. I'm gonna take you to Al Sharon's uh, car lot. I was more impressed with the boy who could, or the gal who could show up in a in a in a fit of flames. Remember that from before? <laughs> <laughs> Truck? Exactly. Because it's there's Chevy, a lot it's of Chevy truck month. Because there's a lot of third degree burns on your face, Mister. You know what? I I got cast as Freddy Krueger. So you know. Oh really? Yeah. <laughs> in the, in the, in the, in the, hey, wait a minute. Weren't you Freddy Krueger and Jerry Maguire? Yes, I was. <laughs>
for time travel now. <laughs> <laughs> right up in here, right up in this pot roast. Okay. I have paprika for some reason. Yeah, Whoa, no, it's fine. smells like 1987, mm. Italy. Can't you taste Dirty Dancing? Oh, Can't I you can. just see Patrick that Swayze dancing? Yeah. Mm. I'm so ready. I just oh. want to go back to my English class so that Miss Fedeberger doesn't give me a seat. That's all. I don't want to eat change your face. Honey, I'm what? sorry. It's not going to change that mug of yours. <laughs> I didn't know that was the pretense to go back in time. Oh. You only took me out as a client because you thought I was ugly and wanted to go back to change my face? If anything, I'd go in the future where there's technology. Let me finish. Technology <laughs> to make something like that happen. I'm done. What? <laughs> as I was saying, we can do a little cut here and one here and, um, uh, remove some of the jowls, but yeah. uh, I'll take some skin out of the swimming pool. Just apply it. <laughs> <laughs> I, I believe that's why your um, associate sent you back in time. It's because only now is it legal to use other people's skin taken Still from. Still thinking that in the future there's better, going to be better technology for something like this. No, nope. yeah, we have uh, laws. We have glass coke bottles in these days. <laughs> <laughs> it's the only time you can get skin for your face. Regulations nowadays are a lot more lax. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So we can get away with a lot more, which you really need, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Hey doctor, I just uh, licked the cheese off this pizza cutter, so it's ready to go. Great, great. We're gonna use, see, we're gonna use that for, for surgery. I, this is... Can I, can I just have one of your cigarettes, Doc? Sure. <laughs> it's made out of nails. <laughs> Why? <laughs> when, <laughs> when did that happen? It's kind of dangerous. It was a fad for about a year. This is a parallel timeline to your world. Yeah. You see, oh. We enjoy just dangerous, really dangerous things. Yeah. Harmful. Right? If it's not really harmful, why bother? It's the only time you can get your face changed. Yeah. Mm -hmm. There's but so many questions I have because it's all time travel and very convoluted. We have all the answers. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes. Angelo Carico. Oh. <laughs> uh oh. oh no. There's a rift in the time warp. Yes. Oh no. Oh no. Wait, 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 don't fall into the world. Oh god. Oh, no. I'm being pulled into face. the other timeline. No. Oh, my face face is face. Face. Oh, no. oh crap. My skills are useless here. Oh no! My face is half pot roast! Does it make any sense? Go ahead, have a nail smoke. Yeah. I wish I could take these gloves off. You can't! I guess. If I dip some of the gravy on your face. Oh, it feels good though. What kind of world is this? Gravy? Oh no! Gravy is legal! for this private hut in Bora Bora for our honeymoon. Oh, I know. Oh, it's so nice. Oh. It sucks that there's so many random band-aids in our private pool. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you, don't, you don't like that? I kind of like that. Well, I haven't, I haven't made up my mind if I like it or not. It's a little more edgy than I was <laughs> thinking. It's too Honestly, edgy. I thought it was a joke when I read about it on Yelp. I thought someone was like... Oh no, I, I was excited for that. That's what really put me over the edge. Really? I wanted some band-aids in the pool. Oh, I love learning new things about you, even after the wedding. Uh, <laughs> be clear! Get <laughs> Wilson, oh, go. Oh my god! <laughs> I got an idea to get us off this island we've been stranded on. So, you know all the band-aids that wash up on the shore? Wilson, they could make a raft and a sail if we just get a few more of them. We just all we got to do, Wilson, Wilson, Wilson! <laughs> So, yeah. Somebody tell me what's happening. That's, so that's why I used to be a volleyball. Oh. That's why I love band-aids and pools. <laughs> hey, wait. Weren't you Wilson's hair and Jerry Maguire? I was. <laughs> that was our show. Thank you.